I think we're live. E hearts. Big give it a second. <laughs> We're so good at this. Do that. <laughs> Drawing sins because we're gay. <laughs> well, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but I just meant art direction wise. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Art. Art. <laughs> that, that other part just goes without saying. I mean, TDH. <laughs> Do you like girls? Yes? Okay, we're gay for saying this the end. <laughs> like part of me wants to actually do the the painty thing. <laughs> but I, I said I'd stop you. <laughs> I said I wouldn't do a single layer again. <laughs> 
look, I give you, like, I lovingly give you shit about that, but that's, like, it actually shouldn't stop you if you want to do a painting paint, <laughs> you know? Oh no, I know. Uh, more just like, I, I know I shouldn't do that to myself, you know what I mean? E. I, I should be smarter about it. <laughs> I mean, yes, but also if you're having fun doing a single layer, it's only if it's something that frustrates you that I'm like, hey, don't do that. <laughs> it's tricky because I do find it fun, but then there are frustrating parts of it. <laughs> e. Understandable. way you do what your heart desires. <laughs> I think I'm going to just sketch it out first, just so I understand how her suit and dread works. Mm -hmm. Since it's, it is a fair bit different from her classic suit, which I'm actually a little more used to drawing. <laughs> that I've drawn her too much, but... Because it's like a mech suit, it has some interesting proportions.
<laughs> Sorry, somebody... Somebody put a TikTok in... Uh... One of the meme channels. <laughs> it was really good. Oh. Basically, somebody... Playing a shooter. Who they say it was. Uh, Warzone. It's just some 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 drab urban shooter looking kind of thing. Mm -hmm. PvP. And some guy suddenly comes over voice chat and it's just like, you know, I've loved you since whatever for for however long and since this game is the first place we ever met, like I feel like this is the perfect place to whatever and the girl who's like streaming is like, Oh my god, is this a proposal? Like she's not a part of it. She's just streaming this is happening. That's incredible. <laughs> and you you know, it's just the guy's like, you know, I love you, will you marry me? And you like after a second you hear another girl voice pop in like, oh my god, yes, I, of course, you know, kind of shit. And the girl's like on stream like <gasps> but then she like fucking fires a rocket and then you just go like oh my god congratulations as she blows them up <laughs> That's pretty incredible. It's incredible. Oh my god, congratulations, that was so cute. <laughs> and now I destroy you. Oh. Uh. It's a Samus. Hey, Satch. Uh, hey, so Satch. I finally got around to Metroid Dread, and I'm like right in the middle of it, and I'm gay. <laughs> so I'm I'm just sketching Samus. <laughs> Okay, you, you did play some of it. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I, I don't know how far I am. I'm into like, I've gotten to a fifth zone, I want to say. But it's like... Because you jump around a lot, it's it's kind of hard to say like where I am right now in the game. To be honest, yeah, they really want you to like yo-yo between zones. Yeah, it's interesting, but it's also like, oh, but I I'm gonna go back and explore and get all the things. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, yeah, I could see that. Valid. I... I need to finish Super Metroid, but <laughs> like... But yeah, I, I am really enjoying it so far. I love how snappy the controls are, and like how fast you go is like really, really fun. It's definitely, I feel like its inspiration is primarily fusion. And, I mean, that makes sense, because it's literally, like, a sequel to Fusion, essentially. But... Yeah, that's exactly what I said, like, watching Peachy do it. I'm like, man, if this control's, like, as snappy and nice as, you know, you're saying it does for you, like, I bet the fucking speed tech for this is crazy fun. <laughs> yeah, I really want to see a speed run after I'm done, for sure. Yeah, for real. Yeah, the parry move is really, like, oh, it feels really good to get it, to be quite honest. Yeah, like, some of the timing looks tricky, but, like, god, getting a parry move always feels so good when you learn it. <laughs> Me learning to frickin' shield parry lasers in Breath of the Wild, just, like, nothing is more satisfying. <laughs> no, it's true. Says right now, trying to figure out how this works. I'm a little more used to drawing classic Samus' suit, so. Yeah, the, and the Emmy sections are really <laughs> intense. Oh god, they're so intense.
my god, eight? Look, look. Satch, I'm the last person to judge. I went super feral over the Omori plushies, so like, <laughs> I get it. <laughs> god, I would kill to pre-order like eight Mendonites. They're so cute. <laughs> They're so cute, and I would like to have like, like, Frisk and Toriel, but I'm like, god, I can't. <laughs> Hugs. Omori is great. The themes are heavy, but if you can handle that, it is very, very good. It, you like Undertale, you like Earthbound, you're gonna like Omori. <laughs> it's very good. Like, yeah, the themes, the themes can be very, very deep, very dark, but like, we feel that they handle it very respectfully, so it's not like it's all ooh, uh, sad things, it's shock value. It feels like a very honest kind of portrayal, so it's not like, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's not sensationalizing it. It feels, it feels good. It sense. feels good, yeah. It, like, it, you're gonna have emotions, but it's been... It's been enjoyable to have the emotions. <laughs> yes. And the art is all wonderful and... Yeah, the art style is super distinct, so like, that's like... It's really good. Yeah, art good, music fucking bangs, just... Just wall-to-wall -wall bangers, honestly. Yeah, the soundtrack is extremely good. Um... You know, the parts that are colorful and fun in between the uh, emotions are, like, very colorful and fun. Good writing, etc. So, uh, yeah, Omori, 10 out of 10, would recommend. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It is long, and there are uh, two routes. There, there's basically a split in the game that's fairly early on. Um... I won't say anything more than that. Just that you so you know that there are two routes in the game. <laughs> so, you know, I've been streaming both routes and it's been taking me a while. But yeah, Satch, I definitely think you, you would enjoy it if you like. <laughs> and I do know that you like Undertale. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it definitely... It definitely feels like a good mix of, like, Undertale, Earthbound, Yume Niki vibes. So it's, like, it's good. It's very good. Mm -hmm. Is it on Game Pass? Huh. Mm. figure out what's going on with the exhaust port here <laughs> on the side. Is it like sticking out like this? Kind of wraps into the
business has always really been mech stuff, armor stuff. <sighs> Something about freaking mechanical stuff. It's just like so detailed and precise and it's like more like being loose and wiggly. <laughs> yeah. And like, I think I've gotten better over the years, but it's still like a lot. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've always really liked your mix stuff. <laughs> so I think. Also, I had no idea that Washo was inspired by Omo Cat. That, that tracks, honestly. <laughs> oh, I didn't know either. Yeah. God, the music video they did together was so good, though. It was very good. Again, Elmo Cat's art is always just so good. <laughs> very styled. situation. Had you seen the latest collab that Toby did? <laughs> that one was also really good, but man, was it also like <laughs> the art. I mean, like, the art was amazing, but oh man. <laughs> yeah, the art was gorgeous, but uh, who? Who would cut curse by the end? Yeah. Uh, he did warn. <laughs> oh, he warned us, and. I survived, but it was also just like, hmm, sour was going, but I'm still like, yikes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Hello, friend. I'm drawing Samus, or at least attempting to. <laughs> There's just so much to pursue. <laughs> There's so many details.
hardest part is gonna be her, uh, I want to call them pauldrons. They're not exactly pauldrons, but... And then, close enough, we know what you mean. Shoulder pads. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, I feel like pauldrons might fit better because they're not very pads. Yeah, they're, they're just not... orbs. They're, they're orbs. Shoulder orbs. They're significantly cut down from her own, like her usual, <laughs> her classic suit, though. <laughs> her classic suit, which were on like fucking World of Warcraft <laughs> pauldron levels. They, they really are. <laughs> fucking paladin slash warrior ass, fucking chonky shit on your shoulders. <laughs> It's like, I have a lot of fondness for the the classic suit, but also, yeah, those those pauldrons drove me kind of wild, because it's really hard to proportion her. Yeah. yeah, it's like, oh yeah, no, we love the classic, but uh, having to be the one to draw it, oh god. <laughs> she ends up and I know it's just the sh shape of the suit, but she ends up having linebacker proportions, right? <laughs> yeah, that's true. She is a big gal, but like... <laughs> it's like, truly, buff Samus is the only correct interpretation, but perhaps not fucking linebacker ass Samus. <laughs> yeah. moves the window on nope. the <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, my lag just caught up to it. It's like, whoa, there it goes. I, was, I, I have my uh, um, references on the same screen, so I was trying to move my reference around and I instead moved the wrong thing. <laughs> Slowly slide. <laughs> friend though last night I played more <laughs> dread and we had another boss fight I had another boss fight and they're really trying to, to kill <laughs> the the willow <laughs> says Jennifer <laughs> they are really out to fucking kill us <laughs> We once again had another Jenna I'm so gay moment, and I'm like, yeah, me too, the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> they are out to get us. This is a targeted attack, and it's working. <laughs> and it's working. <laughs> Oh 
my god, I, I think I, I know which, um, which quest you're talking about, yeah. Excellent. Go get that old man some drug. <laughs> he just wants the speed, man. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to go fast. <laughs> Oh, Breath of the Wild side quests are funny. <laughs> can't wait for Tears of the Kingdom to come out for you to just play that me for a million years. <laughs> <laughs> Yee. <Yeah>. Genuinely. <laughs> Heart. <laughs> Heart. <laughs> Were you gonna grab it yourself at a later date? Probably, eventually. I... Currently, I still have also not eaten Breath of the Wild. Mm -hmm. Uh, just lived it vicariously via you and Matt. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, and so part of me is like, I feel like I shouldn't invest the $70 to get frickin' Tears of the Kingdom until I've, like, actually beaten Breath of the Wild. But I do want to get it eventually. Like, yeah. just because I'm very slow at video games, it's like, I still want to play it someday. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I can't uh, immediately justify it to myself, but eventually. Because mm -hmm. I absolutely do want to uh, fuck around with the new mechanics. You know, without saying what they are. <laughs> <laughs> for context. For yeah. Oh, <laughs> for context, I've been trying very hard. I haven't watched uh, any of the newer trailers, and I've been trying very hard not to spoiler myself on, like, anything. <laughs> yep. The most she has been spoilered on so far is uh, rehydration rehydrated of Gamut. <laughs> yeah. But she has not seen the uh, 10 minutes of gameplay footage, so she does not know any of the new glyphs, so... <laughs> <laughs> Gentle shushing. <laughs> oh man, I'm... I'm simultaneously ready and not ready. <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, I'm I'm very much looking forward to seeing your like blind ass reaction to everything, so I'm I'm, I'm very very excited. <laughs> I'm taking time off for this. <laughs> As you deserve. Oh, it still feels weird. <laughs> she was debating on it and I convinced her very thoroughly, like, no, you deserve time off, take a day off to play a video game. <laughs> The last trailer was very good. I'm very excited. Again, they better let us pet the dog, at least. Yeah, all the shit they're giving us, if they didn't give us dog petting capabilities, I'm gonna be so bummed out. Like, truly, truly the major thing missing from Breath of the Wild. Why couldn't we pet the dogs? What kind of crime is this? Twilight Princess let us pick them up and carry them around like little babies. Where's that mechanic? I know. I know. Bring back bring back the carry animal like child mechanic. Go up to all those border collies and scoop them into your arms like a baby. <laughs> let me pat my horse's face and give them more apples.
I have less games stacked up, I should also play the Metroid Prime remake. It's like, even though I've played Metroid Prime like five bajillion times, I, I've heard that the remake was good, so... <sighs> yeah, as soon as I saw, like, hey, Metroid Prime remake, I was like, Yeah, <laughs> 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 Fucking love that game. Hell yeah. 